Hey everyone, welcome to today's video where we'll be exploring the fascinating world of centenarians, people who have lived to the remarkable age of 100 or beyond. Their life experiences and wisdom hold invaluable lessons for all of us. Imagine meeting someone like Tao Porchen Lynch, a yoga master who continued teaching well into her 90s and even appeared on America's Got Talent at the age of 96. Her secret to a long and fulfilling life? There is nothing you cannot do, she once said. Stories like hers are not only awe-inspiring, but also offer profound insights into what it takes to live a century-long life. In a world where life expectancy continues to rise, learning from those who have already reached the 100-year milestone becomes increasingly relevant. Centenarians have witnessed a century of change, endured countless challenges, and accumulated a wealth of life experience. By studying their habits, mindsets, and philosophies, we can uncover the keys to longevity and apply them to our own lives. Throughout this video, we'll dive into seven surprising life lessons gleaned from centenarians around the world. From the power of positive relationships to embracing a healthy lifestyle, these insights will challenge your perceptions of aging and inspire you to make the most of every moment. So, are you ready to unlock the secrets of a long and fulfilling life? Let's get started. The secret to a long and fulfilling life isn't just about eating well or exercising regularly. One of the most critical factors, as revealed by many centenarians, is the power of positive relationships. Countless studies have shown a strong correlation between social interactions and overall well-being. People with strong social connections tend to live longer, healthier lives compared to those who are isolated or lonely. This is particularly evident in the lives of centenarians who often attribute their longevity to the loving relationships they've nurtured over the years. Take, for example, the story of 102-year-old Liz Smith from Scotland. When asked about her secret to a long life, she simply replied, good friends and lots of laughter. Liz is known for her infectious smile and the way she lights up when surrounded by her loved ones. Despite the challenges she's faced, including losing her husband many years ago, Liz has maintained a positive outlook on life, largely thanks to her strong social support system. Another inspiring example is 108-year-old Esmond Alcock from Canada. Esmond credits his long life to the love and support of his family, especially his wife of 72 years. Even after her passing, Esmond continues to find joy in the company of his children, grandchildren, and great-grandchildren. He believes that the key to happiness is to have someone to love and to hold. But it's not just anecdotal evidence that supports the importance of positive relationships. Numerous studies have delved into the science behind social connections and their impact on health and longevity. For instance, a study published in the Journal of Health and Social Behavior found that older adults with strong social ties had a 50% greater likelihood of survival compared to those with weaker connections. Another study, conducted by researchers at Brigham Young University, revealed that social isolation and loneliness can be as detrimental to health as smoking 15 cigarettes a day or being an alcoholic. On the flip side, having strong social connections was found to boost longevity by 50%. So what is it about positive relationships that contribute to a longer, healthier life? Experts believe that social support helps buffer against stress, provides a sense of belonging and purpose, and encourages healthy behaviors. When we have people who care about us and whom we care about in return, we're more likely to take better care of ourselves and have a more positive outlook on life. As you reflect on your own life, consider the relationships that bring you joy and fulfillment. How can you nurture and strengthen those connections? What steps can you take to build new, meaningful relationships? By prioritizing the power of positive social interactions, you may just be paving the way for a longer, happier life. One of the most striking commonalities among centenarians is their commitment to a healthy lifestyle. While genetics undoubtedly play a role in longevity, the daily habits and choices of these long-lived individuals offer valuable insights into how we can optimize our own well-being. When it comes to diet, centenarians tend to favor whole, 
minimally processed foods. Their meals often include an abundance of fruits and vegetables, whole grains, lean proteins such as fish and legumes, healthy fats from sources like olive oil and nuts. Notably, many centenarians practice calorie restriction or intermittent fasting, which has been linked to improved metabolic health and increased lifespan in various studies. In addition to a wholesome diet, centenarians prioritize regular physical activity. While they may not be hitting the gym for intense workouts, they find ways to incorporate movement into their daily routines, such as walking or gardening, engaging in low-impact exercises like yoga or tai chi, participating in social activities that keep them on their feet. Research consistently shows that maintaining an active lifestyle can reduce the risk of chronic diseases, improve mental health, and contribute to overall longevity. So, how can we apply these centenarian habits to our own lives? Here are some practical tips. Gradually replace processed snacks with fruit, vegetables, or nuts. Experiment with meatless meals featuring whole grains and legumes. Take regular walks in nature, even if just for 15 minutes a day. Find an enjoyable physical activity that you can stick with long term. Consider trying intermittent fasting under the guidance of a healthcare professional. Remember, small changes can add up to a significant impact on your health and longevity over time. By embracing a lifestyle similar to that of centenarians, you're investing in a longer, healthier, and more vibrant future. Resilience is a key trait that many centenarians possess, allowing them to bounce back from life's challenges and maintain a positive outlook. Let's explore how these individuals have developed an unshakable spirit and the coping strategies they employ to foster longevity. Centenarians often demonstrate a remarkable ability to adapt to change and overcome adversity. They view challenges as opportunities for growth rather than insurmountable obstacles. This mindset shift allows them to remain optimistic and find creative solutions to problems that arise. Take the story of Ethel, a 102-year-old who survived the Great Depression and multiple wars. Despite facing hardships, she always found a way to persevere. Life is full of ups and downs, she says, but it's how you react to them that matters. I choose to focus on the good and keep moving forward. So how do centenarians cope with stress and adversity? Here are a few strategies they commonly employ. Maintaining a sense of humor and finding joy in everyday moments. Leaning on strong social support systems during tough times. Engaging in activities that promote relaxation and mindfulness, such as meditation or hobbies. Reframing negative experiences as opportunities for learning and growth. By incorporating these coping mechanisms into their lives, centenarians build emotional resilience and adaptability, which contribute to their longevity. Psychological research has consistently shown that resilience is linked to better physical and mental health outcomes. Resilient individuals tend to have lower levels of stress hormones, stronger immune systems, and a reduced risk of chronic diseases. One study published in the Journal of Personality found that centenarians scored higher on measures of resilience compared to younger adults. The researchers concluded that this trait plays a significant role in promoting healthy aging and longevity. So how can we cultivate resilience in our own lives? Start by adopting a growth mindset, surrounding yourself with supportive people, and finding healthy ways to manage stress. Remember, it's never too late to build resilience and improve your overall well-being. One of the most inspiring traits of centenarians is their ability to maintain a strong sense of purpose and passion throughout their long lives. Despite the passing of decades, these remarkable individuals continue to find joy meaning, and fulfillment in their daily activities and pursuits. Many centenarians attribute their longevity and zest for life to their enduring hobbies and interests. Whether it's painting, gardening, playing music, or volunteering in their communities, these activities provide a sense of purpose and keep them engaged with the world around them. Pursuing passions not only brings personal satisfaction, but also helps maintain mental sharpness and social connections. 
Studies have shown a strong correlation between having a sense of purpose and increased life expectancy. People who feel that their lives have meaning and direction tend to live longer, healthier lives. This is because a sense of purpose can reduce stress and improve mental well-being, encourage healthier lifestyle choices, provide motivation to stay active and engaged. It's never too late to discover new passions or rediscover old ones. Centenarians teach us that age is just a number when it comes to finding purpose and fulfillment. Here are some tips for cultivating purpose at any stage of life. Reflect on your values, interests, and skills. Explore new hobbies or learn a new skill. Volunteer or get involved in your community. Nurture relationships with family and friends. Set goals and work towards them, no matter how small. Remember, purpose doesn't have to be grand or world-changing. It can be as simple as finding joy in everyday moments and making a positive impact on those around you. By embracing our passions and living with intention, we can all learn from the wisdom of centenarians and lead more fulfilling lives at any age. Maintaining mental sharpness is crucial for a long and fulfilling life. Centenarians around the world engage in a variety of cognitive activities to keep their minds active and engaged well into their golden years. Let's explore some of the brain-stimulating activities and learning opportunities that can help you stay mentally sharp at any age. Many centenarians credit their mental acuity to a lifelong commitment to learning and mental stimulation. Some popular cognitive activities among centenarians include reading books, newspapers, and magazines, solving puzzles such as crossword, sudoku, or jigsaw puzzles, playing board games or card games that require strategy and critical thinking, engaging in creative pursuits like painting, writing, or playing a musical instrument, learning new skills or hobbies such as a foreign language or computer skills, incorporating brain-stimulating exercises into your daily routine can help maintain cognitive function as you age. Some effective ways to challenge your brain include Practicing memory techniques such as mnemonics or visualization, engaging in mental math or calculations without relying on calculators, participating in online brain training programs or apps, attending lectures, workshops, or classes on topics that interest you, joining a book club or discussion group to engage in intellectually stimulating conversations. Numerous studies have shown a strong link between mental stimulation and cognitive health in older adults. Research suggests that engaging in mentally challenging activities can improve memory and cognitive function, slow down age-related cognitive decline, reduce the risk of developing dementia or Alzheimer's disease, enhance overall brain health and resilience. By embracing lifelong learning and regularly engaging in brain-stimulating activities, you can follow in the footsteps of centenarians and maintain your mental sharpness well into old age. Remember, it's never too late to start exercising your brain and reaping the benefits of a mentally active lifestyle. So what kind of mentally stimulating activities do you enjoy? Share your favorite brain-boosting hobbies or learning experiences in the comments below, and let's inspire each other to keep our minds sharp and vibrant throughout our lives. Centenarians around the world seem to have mastered the art of living in the present moment and appreciating the simple joys of life. Many express deep gratitude for their experiences, relationships, and the world around them. This attitude of thankfulness appears to be a key ingredient in their recipe for a long, fulfilling life. So how can we learn from their example and cultivate more gratitude and mindfulness in our own lives? Here are some practical techniques to try. Keep a gratitude journal and write down a few things you're thankful for each day. Take a few minutes to savor positive experiences and really soak in the feelings of joy and contentment. Express your appreciation to others through heartfelt words, a handwritten note, or a thoughtful gesture. Practice mindfulness meditation or deep breathing exercises to tune into the present moment. Go for a mindful walk in nature and engage all your senses. Really notice the sights, sounds, smells, and sensations. 
The incredible thing is, these simple practices of gratitude and mindfulness have been shown to have powerful effects on our mental and physical well-being. Studies have found that people who regularly express gratitude have lower levels of stress and depression, stronger immune systems, better sleep quality, reduced risk of heart disease, greater overall life satisfaction and happiness. And mindfulness has been linked with benefits like reduced anxiety, improved focus and memory, and even changes in brain structure that may slow age-related cognitive decline. So by learning from the wisdom of centenarians and weaving more gratitude and presence into the fabric of our days, we could be tapping into a powerful source of mental and physical resilience as we age. I'll leave you with this question to reflect on. What's one small way you could bring a little more gratitude and mindfulness into your day today? Let me know in the comments below and thanks for tuning in. Throughout their long lives, many centenarians have discovered the immense value of generosity and kindness. Altruistic behaviors not only benefit the recipients, but also have profound effects on the giver's well-being. Let me share with you a heartwarming story of a centenarian named Edith from London. At the age of 102, Edith still dedicates her time to knitting hats and scarves for those in need. She believes that her acts of kindness have kept her young at heart and given her a sense of purpose. Edith's story is just one of many examples of how centenarians around the world continue to make a positive impact through their generosity. Research has shown that engaging in charitable behaviors can have numerous psychological and physiological benefits, including reduced stress levels and improved mood, increased feelings of social connectedness and belonging, enhanced sense of purpose and fulfillment, improved cardiovascular health and immune function. By focusing on the needs of others and giving back to their communities, centenarians have found a key to not only living longer, but also living happier and more meaningful lives. So, how can we incorporate more generosity and kindness into our own lives? Start small by performing random acts of kindness, such as holding the door open for someone, offering a compliment, or helping a neighbor with their groceries. As you make these practices a habit, you may find yourself seeking out larger opportunities to give back, like volunteering at a local charity, or donating to a cause you believe in. Remember, it's never too late to start embracing generosity and kindness. As we've learned from centenarians, these simple acts can have a profound impact on our well-being and the lives of those around us. Throughout our exploration of centenarians' lives, one recurring theme stands out, the importance of strong family bonds and supportive social networks. These connections not only provide emotional fulfillment but also contribute significantly to overall health and longevity. Centenarians often attribute their long lives to the love and support they receive from their families. These close-knit relationships offer a sense of belonging, purpose, and joy that can carry individuals through life's challenges. Studies have consistently shown that people with strong family ties tend to live longer, healthier lives compared to those who lack such connections. Beyond immediate family, centenarians also emphasize the value of cultivating a supportive community. This can include friends, neighbors, and members of social or religious organizations. Engaging in regular social interactions and participating in community events can help combat feelings of loneliness and isolation, which are known risk factors for various health issues. Here are some suggestions for strengthening familial ties and building a supportive community. Make time for regular family gatherings and traditions. Engage in open, honest communication with loved ones. Offer support and compassion during difficult times. Join local clubs or organizations that align with your interests. Volunteer for causes you care about to meet like-minded individuals. Reach out to friends and neighbors regularly, even if just for a quick chat. Research has consistently demonstrated the profound impact of positive social connections on overall health and happiness. Studies have found that individuals with strong social networks have lower risks of chronic diseases like heart disease and diabetes, 
reduced rates of cognitive decline and dementia, improved mental health outcomes, including lower rates of depression and anxiety, increased resilience in the face of stress and adversity, higher levels of self-reported happiness and life satisfaction. These findings underscore the importance of prioritizing social connections throughout our lives. By nurturing strong family bonds and building supportive communities, we can not only enhance our own well-being, but also create a legacy of love and resilience that spans generations. Throughout this video, we've explored the incredible wisdom and insights shared by centenarians from around the world. Let's take a moment to recap the seven key life lessons we've learned. The power of positive relationships in promoting longevity and happiness. Embracing a healthy lifestyle through proper diet, exercise, and self-care. Cultivating resilience and adaptability in the face of life's challenges. Finding purpose and passion at any age and pursuing them with vigor. Staying mentally sharp by engaging in lifelong learning and cognitive activities. Practicing gratitude and mindfulness to enhance overall well-being. Nurturing strong family bonds and support systems for a fulfilling life. As we reflect on these profound lessons, I encourage you to ask yourself, how can I start incorporating these principles into my own life? What small changes can I make today that will have a lasting impact on my health, happiness, and longevity? Remember, it's never too late to start living a life filled with purpose, gratitude, and meaningful connections. By taking inspiration from the incredible stories of centenarians, we can all strive to create a more fulfilling and joyful existence, no matter our age. If you found value in this video, please take a moment to like, comment, and share it with your friends and family. Your support helps us continue creating content that inspires and empowers others to live their best lives. Thank you for joining me on this journey of discovery and growth. Until next time, Keep embracing the wisdom of our elders and cherishing every moment of this precious life.